Do not matter on Black Friday. I'm in Beyonce. Beyonce. What's up, guys? This week we're going to be going into rotations, so let's see what all of you guys are going to be doing. All right, Group A, you guys are going to be going to Mass, hosted by St. Peter. People who are attending Mass are St. Rose of Lima, St. Michael the Archangel, St. Cecilia, and St. John the Baptist. In the gym, it's going to be St. Mary Magdalene, St. Augustine, St. Patrick, St. Thomas Aquinas, and St. Juan Diego in order to play some dodgeball. And Group C, you guys are doing a solidarity act in your house room. And that'll be St. Catherine of Drexel, St. Sebastian, St. Anne, St. Joan of Arc, and St. Teresa of Calcutta. So you guys enjoy. Hey guys. Hey, what's I, up, Nate? I was just wondering if you guys wanted to uh, see an interview with Mr. Sweeney, maybe get to know him a little bit better? Sure. sure. All right, let's roll the tape. Hi guys, I'm here with Mr. Sweeney, uh, the new vice principal of Seton Catholic. Uh, how's it going, Mr. Sweeney? It's good, Nathan. Things are going well. Baseball. Baseball. I like the Cubs and the Sox, so I'm kind of partial to them. Oh, okay. Well, I think the, the big project that we're working on is the accreditation process, and what that's going to offer is an opportunity, I think, for the, the school to improve and develop a plan to improve, and I think that that's uh, really exciting because I think it provides us with um, just a chance to, to make things better here. I think probably the commitment of the teachers and uh, the work ethic of the students. I think kids come here to work hard and get smart. And, um, I think the, the teachers here are very dedicated to helping you do that. Um, okay, so in this next part, we're going to have you say two truths and a lie about yourself. And I'm going to try and guess the lie. So, Fair enough. Alrighty. Okay, um, I have four children, two boys and two girls. Um, I try to hide every day from Mr. Cerna. And, um, I taught once in the high school that the breakfast club was made uh, about. Okay, I think the lie is that you try to hide from Mr. Cerna every day. You're right. <laughs> There's so many good bands, and um, I, I don't want to slight any one, but um, the one that's meant the most to me is a band called Five for Fighting, and they've got a song called 100 Years that I really like. Nice. Um, do you know any good jokes? Did, um, did you hear about how they're um, going to take the essay off the SAT? I, I did not. Oh. They're going to call it the T. What advice do you have for students this year? I think more than anything, have fun here and enjoy your time here. Build relationships with your friends and, and really work at, at building those relationships because that's what you're going to remember most. Well, great job, Nate. Yeah, stellar. Hey, thanks, guys. All right, then, well, I guess I'll just be heading out. Uh, I'm all done here, so uh, see you guys in a little right. bit. Later, see you later, Nate. Well, that's all we got time for you guys today. I'm Anthony. That's Brian. And we'll see you guys next time on House News. <laughs>